Hello guys, this is Street Service TV and welcome back to my channel. But before I start the devotional guys, I would like to shout out the following person or, or channel. Yes TV, A Traveler, Len Batong, Rhymes 27 Blog, Grace Soriano, Soundside Channel, Raymar Iscarinas, Kambal Nidistel, Ruil Bagutin, Gladys Carolino, Wendell Muralda, Lin Lin TV, Lai Music Channel, Scarlett Sinaon, Maria Elena Boris Canilas, Emily Mansalay, Anon Sang Kavan, Rosan Biligas, Lisa Store, Susan Kambaya, Jenny G, Hart Ponsalan, May Hit, Pamilyang Lagan Channel, Spadis Pat, Inday Ray Mix Channel, Life Nagay Family Blog, Ning Manalo Blog, Happy Abi TV, Inday Labisaya Blogs, Joji Huyuhoy, Joker Galinda, Joan Bernadette Lasso, Panga Vivi, Takuan Ai, who Wants Channel, Juna TV, Mary Rose Balasi, KJ Babes, Karen BV Love, Roni247 Chavez, Jimafer Oy, Sherlyn Lee Obligar, May Tuayon, Randolph Batong, Limi Carriedo, RA React Mix TV, Capricorn 56, and shout out also sa mga nagpadala ng mga nila, Pangga TV, Chengs TV, Alagan Channel, Isai uh, team Isai Racho, Team Kiguas, and Team Limi Carriedo. Hello guys, how are you we today? No, as much possible guys, sabay talaga natin ang maglabas-labas ng mga ahay, no? Kasi uh, padami ng padami na padami na ang mga cases ngayon natin, no? So, as much possible, stay home, no? Uh, di rin natin alam kung kailan yung ano, yung time natin kaya let's prepare ourselves while we still have time to prepare, no? Kaya nga sabi ko, many wants to seek God at 11th hour but they die at 10:30. Kaya at this time, we really need to prepare ourselves. Okay, guys, let's now proceed to our devotional. Let's open our Bible to Psalms 116 verse 1 to 9. Still, I'm using the devotional study Bible because the words used here is so simplified at maintindihan talaga natin, no? Okay, Psalms 116 verses 1 to 9 says, I love the Lord for He heard my voice. He heard my cry for mercy. Because He turned His ears to me, I will call on Him as long as I live. The cord of death entangled me. The anguish of the grave came upon me. I was overcome by trouble and sorrow. Then I called on the name of the Lord. O Lord, save me. The Lord is gracious and righteous, and God is full of compassion. The Lord protects the simple-hearted when I was in great need. He saved me. Be at rest once more, O my soul, for the Lord has been good to you. For you, O Lord, have delivered my soul from death, my eyes from tears, my feet from stumbling, that I may walk before the Lord in the land of the living. Amen and amen. Okay, guys, let's now pray. Father God, we thank you, God, for this opportunity again you have given us, Lord God, to have this devotional. We pray to God for you leading unto us. Lord, you open up our hearts, uh, mind, soul, body, and spirit, Lord God, that uh, you may indwell in us, that we may also learn from uh, this devotional, Lord God. Lord, help us not to take your word for granted, but instead, let's take it by heart, O oh God, to really move on unto you, especially that we're now in the last days. Lord, lead us, O oh God, in this name we pray. Amen and amen. Okay, guys, our focus verse for this evening is found in uh, Psalms 117, verse 7, and it says, Return to your rest, my soul, for the Lord has been good to you. Amen. No, I'll claim that verse. Okay, claim it also, guys. The title of our devotion for this evening, guys, is You Have to Relax. Okay. You must relax, pronounces a doctor, uh, Chris Ply, or crisply in Disney's Rescure Down Under, attempting to treat the injured albatross Wilbur 
a reluctant patient. Relax. I am relaxed. I clearly not relax. Wilbur responds sarcastically as his panic goes. If I were any more relaxed, I'd be dead. Can you relate? In light of the doctor's devious method, sucks as chainsaw, dub, and epidermal tissue disruptor, disruptor Wilbur misgiving seem justified. But the scene is funny because it captures how we tend to feel when we're panicking. Whether or not what we're facing is actually life-threatening. Yes, ito ngayon. No? Ang nakakasakit pa minsan guys, pinag pinagtatawanan pa tayo ng mga tao. No? Uh, that makes us more stressed. Kaya, yun, let's just be relaxed instead. Calm down, pray, meditate. No? Okay. When we're terrified, encouragement to relax can feel ridiculous. Yes, no? Para ganun talaga. I know when I feel life's terror uh, piling up around me. I mean, painful curds of death tighten my stomach into nuts. My every instinct is to fight back, not to relax. Bakit kay ganyan talaga yung nangyayari, no? We always fight back instead of relaxing. And yet, more often than not, my panic attempt to fight back into tighten anxiety vice grip, leaving me crippled by fear. But when I, albeit reluctant, allows myself to feel my pain and lift it up to God, something surprising happens. The knot inside the, me relaxes a bit, and a peace I can understand rushes through me. And as the spirit comfort, comforting presence surrounds me, I understand a bit more the truth out, at the heart of the gospel. We fight best when we surrender into the powerful arms of God. May struggle talaga guys, no? Uh, kaya ko to, kaya ko to, no? But instead, Lord, sabihin na natin, Lord, without you, I can do nothing. Yung pride talaga ng tao, andyan talaga, no? Uh, maski naghihirap na, uh, fight pa rin, fight pa rin, lalo-lalo na sa illness, no? Uh, gusto pa rin, ano. Uh, yun nga, guys, no? May, I met somebody na stretch talaga kasi may illness siya, pero denial siya. Uh, always, uh, pinipray namin siya. And then, yun nga, because of pride, sabi niya, I'll just serve God when I'll get old. So, naging old na siya. So, uh, namatay. At wala na talaga siya ang um, ano, chance na nag, ano, makapag-serve sa kay Lord. So, let's not wait for time na maging matanda na tayo na wala tayong magawa. Saka pa tayo mag-serve kay God. Habang we still have the strength to move on to do things for God, let's do it for His greater glory. Kaya, kasi, ano, eh, on our own, we can really do nothing. That's why we need God in our lives. So, let's proceed to the two questions, guys. What struggles do you think of as court of death in your life? Uh, ito nangyayari sa atin ngayon na we cannot just uh, go out of our house. Dito pa lang sa, ano namin, uh, sa bayan namin, ano, pataas ang pataas talaga yung... Almost every day may namamatay. Kaya nakatakot na talaga na lumabas. No? Uh, kung pwede pa lang, isahang labas ng bahay. Bili ng ganun, punta sa na merkado, no? ng palengke, mag-grocery. Isang labas na lang for it all. No? So yun ang struggle ko and I know that's also your struggle. Second question, how could you grow in surrendering to God's love and care? In the hard times. Well, I also take this as, as an opportunity to become closer to God. Kasi wala ka magawa. Nasa bahay ka lang. Uh, nakikinig na music. Yun yung ginagawa ko. No? As I always uh, say, meditate, read the Bible, pray. Pero most of the time, nasa prayer talaga ako. No? Uh, I'll just use the opportunity to become closer to God kesa yung wala ka magawa talaga na idol lang yung time mo. 
No? Okay, so let's pray, guys. <clears throat> God help us surrender our desperate attempt at control and let go of the burdens we weren't meant to be here to. Find rest in your grace and goodness. Amen and amen. Yes, guys, may we find rest in God. Okay guys, sana may natutunan tayo sa devotional natin. No? Let's uh, continue to have this devotional every night at 8 o'clock. No? And after this, uh, dalagi ko guys na siyempre I'm, I'm praying for you sa la, mga lahat ng mga pumupunta dito. I'm, I'm really praying for you. No? So dalagi ko na we will all grow in the Lord. Yes, I will borrow again the words from Campus Crusade for Christ. Share the word of God with the presence of the Holy Spirit and leave the result to God. Okay, guys, God bless us all because I know God would surely bless us 10 times better. This is again Rich Bridge TV. Kita-kita tayo muli at hanggang sa muli. Paalam! Music